Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Pravin Kumar Gurmi Set. Today we'll see one of the SQL entry requests that is, I want to print 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 by using SQL queries. Okay, so there are so many different ways are there. Okay, I should, at least we should have three to four ways we can able to discuss with you. See, so my requirement is that what, okay, I want to print 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 or 1 to 10 numbers. Okay, so by using SQL queries, you could see different approaches. If you want to solve this requirement, you should have better understanding of the following concept. Like, okay, so that's in the DL, data retrieval that is, select statement, qualify keyword, CT, okay, so common table expression, row number, analytical function, connected by level, set operators, and column layers, okay, see, select statement, qualify keyword, so CT, common table expressions are with class, so analytical function, connected by level, set operators, column layers, okay, if you know this concept, like, okay, like, we can able to easily understand the requirement, okay, so my requirement is that what, I want to print 1 to 5 numbers, or 1 to 10 numbers, or 1 to 100 numbers, so based on the requirement, okay, so, okay, in different ways, so we'll see this one in practical. Okay, okay now we'll see this one in practical. So our requirement is that what I want to print one, two, three, four, five, or one, two, like, okay, depends on the, like, uh, like, into, into that. Okay. Now what happened, okay, now we'll see simple example, okay, approach one. Okay, so approach one. So what's the approach, okay, so if you want to select one from do here. Okay, so see this thing. So you'll get what? You'll get out as such an equal. You'll get what? One. Okay, this is one thing. In a similar fashion, so select two from do here. Okay, so first is first is a simple approach that thing. Okay, in a similar fashion, copy the same thing. Okay, put here, put here, and put here. Okay, so one, two, three, four, and four. Okay, so see. So first one, you will get separate, separate. Okay, three, four, and five. Okay, these are what okay, these are what separate will say. Okay. How can I clock into single is we go for what concept? Okay, that's not bad. Isn't it? Set operator. Set operator that is union. Oh, okay, so I'm going for union. So it will simply club first with the second result set. Okay, so you can go for union all. So take the same thing. Okay, like this. Okay, it's a simple approach, but it is not recommended okay, for understanding. Then another fashion. Okay. 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 So the same thing, what will get what? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, got the point. So this is one approach is by using what by using set up that is union R. Okay, got the point. Like simply, okay, I'm taking first result set. So second result set by using set up that you can able to do this. Okay. In a similar fashion, we see the second approach. What is the second approach? Okay. Second approach. Okay. So connect by level. Okay. So connect by level. Okay. So connect by level won't work in snowflake. Okay. So I will show in variety database. Okay. So I'll go to switch to variety database. Okay. So see what happens. Select star from real world. We'll get X. Okay, now what happened? Okay, now we'll go for connect by level. Okay, okay. Select level from dual connect by level. So connect by level less than or equals to two. So it will give what it will give. What happened? It will give. So one two. Suppose instead of two, if I put three, it will give one two three. Okay. Suppose if I want to put five, we can able to put five. Okay. Suppose our requirement is that what I want to print one two five, we can able to put five. Sin connect. Okay. Select level from dual. Connected by level less than or equal to five. Suppose I want to print fifty number into like this one to raise or six. Suppose I want to print a reverse manner. What we'll do? Simply put order by order by level or order by one this one. Okay, into reverse. So let's see. So one approach is by using what by using union all. Second approach is by using connected by level. So connected by level working only for actual database. Okay, so okay, so I have to go back to the thing. So we'll go for other thing. Other use case is that what first first approach is that what by using what concept? So by using union all second approach by using connected by level. Okay, it's working for actual database. Okay. And third approach is that what by using. So which approach we can able to go for? We can go for what? Okay, so with the class. Or you can say it's a CD. Okay. So common table expression. Okay. So suppose selecting one from do you okay so you'll get like this suppose in a similar fashion i'm putting union of select two from real okay suppose i want to club into single then what happened go for what okay so i want to put in the same thing now what happened with the class with the ct as so this entire thing so this is the syntax so this entire thing so this entire thing we are putting into this suppose we're not able to follow so this is the same thing suppose i'm putting probably Okay, so when I this, what happen? Out will be what out the output will be so probably. So probably, and I'm giving some alias column alias. 
Now this entire result set we are we want to put into some some variable so that we can able to okay. So this entire result set we are putting CT. So it's a common table expression. So select this style from CT. Okay, so see the same thing. We'll get what like this okay. So this entire thing we are putting okay, this variable is a common table. So it lacks a temporary table. From there we can able to see. We are okay in a similar fashion. Suppose if I put union all same thing select two mark from do you okay now what happened now see, see this is a separate result set okay now what happened i want to take this entire result set and i want to put in this class from this where we can able to access it so, okay now this will access a table suppose like i want to get where okay i want to do anything where okay so where where what nm equals to okay so this way we can have, okay like this way you can have clearer like this way you can have so this is okay well, this is what cta concept here so by using cta concept we can able to get the things okay so clear so like first understand what c is not but common table expression this entire result set we are putting in this variable and we are able to access this for it so this is so far good okay one second okay so by using this concept we can now i'm going for okay reverse cp okay i should like select one num from dl okay this is what this is one thing now what happened in a similar fashion i'm going for what okay i'm using reverse recursive cp okay reverse. so same table you're trying to get so you can able to get a union all select num okay so suppose we're not able to follow okay so take the same thing remove now what happened with cp as okay so bracket open bracket so select star from okay suppose like select num from ct okay so ct well, now what you get will get out this one okay now what happened okay i'm going for reverse recursive not reverse it's a recursive ct okay i can put so i'm using union all we should use the union on keyword then what happened okay select num plus one so this is the column so this is the column not know what happened okay recursive seat is nothing but what okay from the same table okay so since table i'm trying to use here from cd how long we need to use if we need to use what okay so we should what okay we should use where now okay num less than five okay, so see this thing we get some idea okay see the same thing okay getting a little bit at least okay so see what i'm trying to say okay so not able to follow one more time so select okay so one num from b so what is the output out will be what out will be We'll get one okay but what we want to print we want to print one two three four okay now why using what with class okay with ct okay can we put any name ct as bracket open bracket close okay okay so bracket close now what happened this entire the like entire the set okay this entire result we are taking and we are putting into the ct this is not but common table expression so same thing so select star from so ct okay now what happened you get We'll get one, but we want what one, two, three, four, five. Now, now I'm using what concept recursive. Seat. Okay, same CD. I'm trying to use inside this thing. Okay, we should use union all as a keyword. We should use here. Okay, so select. So we want what? Okay, we want one, two, four, five. We should increment num plus one. Okay, see num. Okay, so already one is there. How how many times we want to look? We want to look for okay five times. Okay, then we should go for from CT CT CT. Okay, where num less than five. So see this thing. So see this entire result set. Okay, so first we are taking this value. We are adding one value. So we are putting CT. The same CT we are putting here. Num plus one. Okay, num plus one. So where num less than two. Now output will be like so. What quantum? So by using what? By using CT. So it's common table expression. You should understand like a little bit confusing. It's a common table expression. So it's with plus this entire result set we are putting. So you can able to suppose like even something like CCC. Okay, so same name we need to put here. Okay, so any name we can able to. Okay, so output will be same. So getting the point. This is nothing but what. So by using recursive CT, we can able to print one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So first one put hundred. We can able to put the same. Same. Okay. Got the point. Like this. Okay. So based on like interview perspective, like how many records you want? This is nothing. So we just need to so num num plus one. So how long were we can able to do? So this is one more approach. Okay. Got the point. So in a similar fashion, what again? In a similar fashion, we we'll go for other approach. Okay. So first now what what is the approach? First approach is that what by using So simple approach that what by using union all okay so just club clubbing this is not like recommend like okay we have one to three records here but if you have more records no you can't double write like this okay manual okay so this is the first approach second approach by using connected by level okay third approach by using recursive CT 
we'll go for fourth approach. Okay. So what the fourth approach by using analytical function. Analytical function we can able to use. Okay. So what the point of like so many approach again. So analytical functions we can able to use. Okay. So what the analytical we will go for a row number. Okay, there's so many analytical functions. Right like now we'll go for row number. Okay, so like so syntax for row number is that what okay, row number bracket open, bracket close over. So we should use order by class, okay, order by column. Okay, as an This is the syntax. So same thing. Now what happened? I'm trying to use one table. Okay, so the information schema. Select star from information schema. Okay, dot anything. Okay, so any table. Okay, so as you like one table is there. Okay, it's having so many records are there. Now what happened? Now, so see so many records are there. Now what happened by using row number? Okay, take the same thing. Okay, list of star row number. Okay, over order by order by anything. Okay, I'm putting order by one, something like this. Now, see, there are so many records will come up there. So, go back here. Okay, see, so one. Okay, so but we want only five records. Okay, we are having what? Okay, in Snowflake, we are having one concept is okay, qualify keyword. Okay, so use qualify keyword, qualify rn rn less than equals to five. It will print first two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. Five. Okay, so got the pointer. So, see there. Okay, so if you don't want our okay, we can go for Okay, so what I did, so I'm using a row number, I'm taking one table, any table. Okay, if you have it, should have at least five records. Okay. So information schema dot tables. So by using row number, okay, just we are doing order. Like just what row number will give what is giving numbering. It will give, it will give number, number. Okay, so okay, so mainly for analytical functions for analysis. Just I want to give numbering. Okay, how can you go by using row number over order by one something like this? We'll get like this. So now by using qualify keyword, we can able to. So same thing, copy the same thing. Now we'll see. Okay, another database okay, with part. So take thing, same thing. Now what happened? It won't work. Okay, call for keyword won't work and information. So now we'll go for what? Okay, we'll go for so select star from okay all underscore objects or anything. Okay, so anything. Okay, so metadata information I'm taking. So all underscore objects. There's so many cards are there. Now what we want? Okay, we should go for row number. Okay, instead of star, use row underscore number. Okay, bracket open, bracket close over. Okay, order by order by one. Okay, see what happened to you. Numbering, but what you can't be want to get only five. Okay, then what happened? We'll go for we are having one concept is where row num less than or equals to five. Okay, so by this concept, we can have to get one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so go to find a, something. Number. Okay, so what okay, so like okay, in different database, we should approach okay, the same concept. Okay, so row number is what, what happened. So, we're like, okay, some in snowflake, we're having call five keyword and we're having row number. So, like, so, okay, the syntax is same, but what happened? The concepts are like, like, the syntax will be like the difference, concept will be same. Okay. So what happened? We see one more time. So by using what concept? Okay. So first step is that what by using union all we can able to go. So simple step. Second approach is by using connected by concept under play level concept. Third step is by using what by using what concept by using. So by using what? So recursive city and fourth step is by using okay by using what concept analytical function. Okay. So by this we can able to get okay. So like this. Okay. Okay. Hope this is clearer. So like okay. For remember for, for every for every question at least you show. Two to, three, two to three answers for the question. Okay, then only can able to back any type of SQL interface or Snowflake interface. Okay. So this is clear. So one more time, see, go back here. Okay, so see the same thing. Now, what is the requirement? Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so it can be actually by using three. That's why I asked. Okay, you know, qualify keyword, common table expression, row number concept, connect by level concept, set of objects. So if you know this concept, like you can able to solve any type of the requirement. Okay, hope this is clear. Okay, if you like the content, subscribe and share the channel. Thank you for watching.